Hello, this is Kenny Moore from TaggedPDF.com, continuing a series of short tutorials intended to help optimize PDF documents for assistive technology and mobile device users by meeting the new PDF accessibility requirements of the 508 Refresh. In this video, we will explore another error encountered using PAC2, the excellent free PDF accessibility checker. And the error is this one. Link annotation is not nested inside a link structure element. The category for this error is logical structure, structure elements, annotations. The failure condition in the Matterhorn protocol reads, a link annotation is not nested within a link tag. This video will present this suggestion for resolving the error using Adobe Acrobat Pro. And it will use this example PDF, which if you would like, you're free to download and use to practice solving this error. In pack two, I have the example PDF loaded. So I can click start. And you can see we get the angry red X that uh, scolds us. This PDF contains errors, only partially accessible. So I'll click the report button. And in the report, I will drill down to the error. When I click on the error, it shows us the location of the problem link in the document. In Adobe Acrobat Pro, I'm going to scroll down and find the link that's giving us the trouble. And it is this one. So I'm going to open the Tags pane, then select the Touch Up Reading Order tool. I don't like the dialog that comes with it, so I'm going to close that. And I will select the link. And in the Tags pane, click the little down arrow by the Options, Find Tag from Selection, and that finds the link that's giving us trouble. Now if I take a look at a different link, for example this one, I can see that the link tag should have nested within it both the text within the link and the link annotation, this OBJR thing. When I look at the one that uh, is giving us the error, it has the text, but it doesn't have the, uh, the link annotation. And if I look right above it, there's our link annotation. That's in the wrong place. So I'm going to grab that, drag it inside the link tag, and that looks good. So that should do it. And I'm going to, as always, save as a new file name, just in case something went wrong. I want a way to backtrack and not lose too much work. Back in pack 2, I'm going to load the remediated PDF, click start, and we get our very good friend, the happy green check mark. This PDF is technically accessible. Thank you for viewing this tutorial. I hope it was helpful. This is Kenny Moore. Please feel free to contact me using the Contact Kenny page at taggedpdf.com. Accessibility is the right thing to do.